HIC Microsite Tutorial How to update the firmware via HIC Microsite app and computer. Before you start, make sure you have downloaded the HIC Microsite app. The app is available in the Google Play Store and the App Store. Step 1. Connect your device with the HIC Microsite app. Therefore, you must turn on the hotspot in the device menu. Find the Wi-Fi name HICMicro underscore serial number and connect by entering the password, which can be checked at the hotspot in the menu. Note, if the password is not displayed, please upgrade the device to the latest version or enter the serial null as the password. Log on and activate the device in the app. Then start the live view. Step 2. Open Me section at the bottom right of the site app. Step 3. Choose the device you wish to update. Then tap Device Upgrade to start the firmware download. After downloading, connect your device again via hotspot and agree to upgrade your device. It will take about 15 minutes for the firmware to be installed. Please wait until the firmware is installed completely. During the upgrade process, please do not lock the screen, manually lock the screen or exit the background so as to avoid the upgrade failure. If you use the HIC site version 2.0.0, you can easily find it from the home interface. Confirm your firmware update in your device menu. Part 2. Easy firmware update via computer. Before you start, make sure the hotspot function is disabled. For devices with replaceable batteries, please make sure to remove any batteries before connecting to your PC. This step varies to different models. You can get the firmware upgrade package from the official website www.hikmicrotech.com forward slash en forward slash Unzip the upgrade package, including main firmware, FPGA firmware. Note, this step varies to different models. Note, do not modify the file name. Keep the suffix .dav unchanged. This upgrade process of different models is slightly different. Please refer to the release note of the specific model for more detailed information. Connect the device to your PC with cable and turn on the device. Note: To make sure your PC can identify the device, it's recommended to use our standard USB cable. It's recommended to keep it turned on for 10 to 15 seconds to ensure that the device can be read normally. Open the detected disk, copy the unzipped.dav file and paste it to the root directory of the device. Hold the power button to reboot the device and the device upgrades automatically. The upgrading process will be displayed in the main interface. Note: During the upgrade, make sure the device is connected to the computer. Otherwise, it will cause unnecessary upgrade failure, firmware damage, etc. The device will automatically complete the whole upgrade process. Please confirm the version number in the device information interface. Note, if the device doesn't support firmware 2 in 1, then you need to upgrade the FPGA firmware separately via repeating steps 1 to 3. This will take about 15 minutes.